All right. In sin. All, All right. right. But because of God's grace Amen. and the love that He had for come us, on. yeah, come on, Ken. Sent His Son. Yes. He sent His Son for yes, us. Yeah. We was born and shaken in iniquity. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Lost. No destination, just hell bound. Mm -hmm. But God. Yes. But God. With his unmerited favor, with his unmerited love, yes. which is grace. But God sent his son to get it right. Yes. Yes. So we can get it right in him. Yes. Yes. So as I was reading Ephesians the 2, 8 through 10, for by grace you are saved through faith. Yes. Faith. We know what faith is. We all know faith is things that we can't see, but your mind and your heart believe that it shall come to pass. Yeah. Yeah. Not works, lest any man should boast. Yeah. For we are his workmanship created in Christ. Yeah. And yeah. I began to deal with workmanship. As I thought, I said, he is the potter and we are the clay. And he began to mold us and make us for us to go out and to compel men, to draw men back into his grace into his fellowship so we got to understand when he put us together he making more that it's not our will but it's the will of the Lord yeah. it's not that we should boast and brag about what we're doing but it's the will of the Lord that we go out and compel men yeah. to bring men All back right, into Christ right. amen. amen we have to humble ourselves yeah. right. humble ourselves before the Lord and go what do you help me to do God what do you want me to oh, say it goes back to your grace what do you want me to do and say and reach out to men to bring men in. Yeah. And then when you bring them in, we have to be that example. Amen. We have to be that example. Oh, I brought them in. Oh, I brought him in. I brought. It's not you. Right. It's God that's for you. You plant the seed and he will water and he will right. grow. It's not you. It but it's you. It's yeah. God. It's the process that we go through. Amen. Amen. It's Amen. not an easy process. Yeah. All right. I'm not going to tell nobody living saved is an easy process. I ain't but 41. Y'all know y'all older than I am. It's not an easy process. Flesh get weary sometimes. Flesh want to get out and do what flesh want to do sometimes. But it's a process. I was just asking my mom. I said, if you suffer with them, you will reign with them. He said right here, said, if you suffer a little while, he will make you perfect. He will strengthen you. Yes. You know, and, and, and as I was reading, I first started off with, with 1 Corinthians 15 and 10 is where I got my topic for I am who I am because of God's grace. Oh, say, but by the grace of God, I am what I am. You're looking at a miracle standing before you this morning. Amen. As I said before, I lost my dad, Bishop, <clears throat> the week before my 40th birthday. Amen. So I was planning this big, I said, big bang of a party. Mind what I'm saying. All right, all right. I'm sanctified. Yeah. Living for the Lord. Yeah. And I planned this big, big bang of a 40 party. All right. All this stuff and this and that. And Dad, you know, Daddy gonna come. He don't usually come to my little parties. Daddy gonna come. I think about it again. I said, okay. Okay, so I went on and planned my little party. I asked him again. I said, Daddy gonna come to my 40 party? He said, yeah, I'll be there. My party was set. My birthday is May 21st. My party was set for the weekend, I think the weekend of and May 12th. My dad was called home. The week of my, before my 40th birthday. All right, all right. He did like a ton of bricks. Yeah. And I began to call people and tell people the party council. Yeah, I had to cancel the DJ. I had to cancel the margarita machine. Oh, I, had to I, mean, I had to cancel everything. Because I was on. The party was going to benefit everybody. All right, all right. Everybody was going to be able to enjoy that 40 yeah, birthday yeah. party. Amen. Dad went on home to glory. So I still had the party just for family. You know, we came and we, we hugged and we ate. Aunt Teresa cooked. She, she catered, did everything for me. So we began to go on in life, you know, try to put our pieces back together because he saved Amen. He will give you strength. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Mom being the first lady, we kept on shopping. Right. We didn't miss people. Mm -hmm. We didn't miss church. Mm -hmm. People begin, you know, lose people in their family, they'll miss church. Yeah, yeah. Right. Right. But church is where your strength lies. Yeah. Yeah. We didn't skip a beat. That Sunday when we met them that Friday, that Sunday morning, we was back at it. Right. Cut the rug. Right. Giving God the glory because we know. 
yeah. the life that he lived. It wasn't, yeah. I had to think about what was going on, but we knew the life that he lived. So yeah. we began to put the pieces back together, going through life, and thanking God for just strengthening my mom. 42 years of being with this man. All right. Since she was 14 years old. That's all she knew. So we prayed for first day of strength. Went on through that, you guys. Year came around April 29th. I am who I am. All right. Come on now. Because of God. All right. Oh, yeah. Come on, how did you, Lord? Leaving my mom's house and we're going down the Bentway in in line for traffic. I hear a car screeching. I look up. I say, hold. I say, I say, hold yourself. Hold on. Hold on. Car hit me from the back. Bam. We turned, I hit another car head on, bam. After that, we flipped. I felt the impact. All right. But at the time, back in the day, and when I had a record when I was 16, first thing I said was a curse word. <laughs> but this time I said, Jesus. When I hit that impact, I said, Jesus. What happened right then? He shielded us. He covered us. I looked at my mom. And we on this side, I just need to know that, that you breathe. Mama, it's like she came out of a daze. So the people came, rushing y'all. I'm steady saying, Jesus. I know that's right. I know that's Come on right. now. I don't bucket that seatbelt. I walked out that window. It felt like a door. I walked out a window, hit the ground. That was it. Three months later, three broken vertebrae. In my back. Couldn't walk. Nobody but you, Lord God. Couldn't go to the restroom. Could 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 walk. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm in my bed. Crying. Lord, what happened? Why? What's your purpose? What's your purpose for me? Dad died just over a year ago. Now I'm laid up. What's your purpose for me? What you trying to tell me? I'm laying there. My aunt would come over, my cousins would come over, my uncle came over, people was coming, they was looking at me. They was praying, come on, you gotta get this. I can't move nothing. You know, my aunt would pray, my mama came by, people was coming by. I can't move nothing, y'all. When I tell you I can't move nothing, I couldn't move. They had to drag me to the ritual. Couldn't bend, couldn't sit up. But the grace of God. It's who I am, yeah. why I am today. Yeah. His grace, his unmerited favor, his love. But you know, as I was thinking, grace can't leave out his mercy. Amen. Amen. We know it's about the grace, but I couldn't leave out his mercy. Yeah. You know, my angel would come, she would take, take one step, can you? Take two, come on, come on. It's on video. I had, I, I had to put it on video so I could show people. She said, come on, ain't it, baby? Step one. And in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Every step, God. In the name of Jesus. That day would go by. She'll come over the next day. Amanda, come on, get up, girl. Get up, girl. Get up, girl. But God was speaking to me. As I lay there, I would cry, 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 cry. The work that I have for you, the party that you plan, you see it didn't go through. Mm. Come on now. All right. Things that you desire to do is not of you. All right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's not your purpose. I have called you from the womb. Yes. yes My mom say, I, you've been sanctified since the womb. Yes. yes. You came out sanctified. Yes. Right. You're going to live a sanctified life. Yes. And that's not going to say, I can say, I'm sanctified, set apart. Yes, things don't come. Yes. But God's yes. grace will yes. keep us. Yes. And I thought about that she broke down her grace. I broke down my own grace too. Oh, my <laughs> All right. All right. During the time that I say, God, He He will He will convert our life as you begin to think. He will comfort you. Yes, He will. In your time of sorrow. Amen. Yeah. He'll be that heaven. My mom would say, you know, people say in the song, when your mother's gone, he'll be a mother for you. When your father's gone, he'll be a father for you. Amen. But I thank God. I used to call on daddy for a whole lot, but daddy's gone. Yeah. So now I have no choice but to call on God. All right. 
No choice but the call of God, but my grace for me tells me that G is God. God who are, who know all and he sees all are reaching. Come on. He's reaching out. Yeah. Come on. Compelling me. Come on. Come on. Come on. Yeah. Come on unto me. Come on unto me. Yeah. Hey, his arms. A soapy, yeah, and he can wrap them around oh, yeah. the whole world. Yeah, see, covering. Yeah, he covered me in that accident. Yeah, he covered my mom yeah. in that accident. Yeah. he covered that third passenger in that accident. Yeah, E is for everyone. You're not exempt. Come on, now. you're in the family as well. Amen. Come on, it's not just me that he's covering. Come he's on. covering everybody. So God, reaching arms, covers. Everyone. Yeah. Yeah. Don't feel like because you didn't fail or you didn't sin in this area. Come on. Pick yourself up, dust yourself up, pack your feet, and keep yeah. on moving. Yeah. That's the kind of God that we serve a God of grace, a merited love. He will show grace if you do to do do good to him. Amen. You just can't come to him any kind of way. Oh Lord, Amen. oh yeah, I did that. Oh, Saturday night I'm going to this Sunday morning, I'm back shout. No. Yeah. You have to give up the world. All right. All right. All right. We have to give up the world. Amen. All through Jesus Christ, nevertheless, suffer in this world, but your suffering will only last for a little while. Amen. Come on, put your hands together just to know your suffering yes. only lasts for a little while. Yeah. But by the grace of God, I am Monica Edwards. I am who I am yes. because of God's grace. God's what I say? Reaching arms. Yeah. Covering everyone. Amen? Amen. Put your hands together. Amen. <laughs>